This video will show you how to export an online MIDI sequence as an MP3 using this online sequencer tool. So here I've made um, a little chord progression with a bass line and vibraphone part. It sounds like this. And so on. Now, suppose I want to uh, save this as an MP3 file. This is currently MIDI information, and we want to save it as a sound file. So MP3 is a sound file. What I'll do is I'll go over to where it looks like a cloud. You see when I float over this, it says save. And what I'll do is I go to this little triangle right next to the cloud where it says show options. I click on that, and down here you see it says export MP3. That's what we'll do. I'll click on that. It is recording it. And here is the file right to here. It's called untitled2.mp3. If I want to find that, I can click on this arrow right here and say show in Finder. It'll be in the downloads folder typically. Uh, on your computer, it might you know uh, go to a different folder by default. All right, and here's the file right here. Uh, when you upload these files to Canvas, please be sure to um, name them with your last name and then with the number of the progression. For example, progression 2. Okay, uh, So there's my file, and that is what you can upload to Canvas. Uh, that's all you need to know to save an online sequencer file as an MP3. Take care.